Rodney, welcome to Doncaster Rovers and Club Doncaster. How did all this behind you, the kit vote 2016-17, come about? Well, it, it really all started a long time back when we got involved with the Old Man Football Association through a sister company. And through that we got introduced by Sir David Richards, who I knew well, the then chairman of the Premier League, uh, to the manufacturer FBT based in Thailand. Um, one of our people went over to meet them, huge manufacturer, biggest sport clothing producer in Thailand, employ over 2,000 people, and they supply a lot of sports clubs, not just football, in Thailand, uh, but also into the wider Asian market. And the more we talk to them, the more we like the, the people. It's a family-run business, mother, father, two sons and daughters. And we began to talk to them about supplying the kits to the Oman Football Association. Uh, and out of that, because we got on so well, we talked about starting a joint venture. So one of my companies and FBT in Thailand now have a joint venture which is called FBT Europe. And I mean, they are, it, it, I could not overstate how accommodating they are. The products are, are first class and your fans will judge what they think about the quality. Um, we want them to feel that the final decision is their choice on shirts, home and away. That's why we encourage them to become involved in the design and decision making process. The ties, even in the last seven days, have accommodated two last minute changes, changing one of the away designs uh, from a, a yellow cross on a red background to a yellow cross on a, and flown over the samples. They are, and they are delightful people to work with. Um, we signed a deal with the Football League Trust three months ago, oddly enough it was done here at Doncaster. Uh, from that we started discussions with Club Doncaster um, uh, who were interested in getting a quote from us for the supply of uh, the kits for, the, for the, all everyone involved in Club Doncaster. The ties were very, very supportive and we came up with an offer that Club Doncaster were pleased to accept.